I've never worked for anyone, not ever, never. And a lot of my friends will come to me and say, what do I need to do to like get this started? And I will say, you just got to get started. When I first started this podcast, it was every entrepreneur that I know, every like DIY person that I knew is who I started just having on. If you're out there and you're making your own way, let's talk about it. How did you get here? How, how is it? That... But I know that a lot of those guys and gals do just barely make it through some days, let alone weeks, months, right? It's like this survive instead of strive comparison. What's the point of it? Exactly. And I think then you you see what weekends devolve into for a lot of people, right? So it's this, I got to survive the week and then Saturday and Sunday, I'm going to let off steam, which a lot means different things to different people. But in our culture often means drinking a lot. Mm -hmm. And then Monday arrives, they hate it and they start the cycle all over again. And I have this passion for when I talk to people, because I've always run my own stuff. I've never worked for anyone, not ever, never. And a lot of my friends will come to me and say, what do I need to do to like get this started? And I will say, you just got to get started. You just got to just get started. You want to open a restaurant? Go find a space, find out how much it is. Talk to your friends, raise some money, get rolling or start smaller, start a food truck, but just start, get started. And the passion that that ignites for some people. It's very stressful starting businesses, as you know, but I have found, and maybe your uh, relationship with anxiety or stress is different. I have no anxiety. I have no stress when I am all in on the moment, mm -hmm. when I am all in on the project, when I'm all in on the plan. None. Well, what does it mean to be all in, right? Yeah. And it's the downtime that I like holidays, like hard. That's not an easy time for me because we're not, we're not chasing, we're not building, we're chilling and doing family mm -hmm. time, which is important, but is just not necessarily my favorite thing to do. Um, yes, all in means something different to different people for mm -hmm. sure. So you, when you say all in meaning fully present in what it is that you're doing. Yeah. Because fully I think immersed. a lot of anxiety, like you said, there's, there's several different, um, opinions of what anxiety is. There's different clinical definitions of what it is, but it is often thinking about things you don't have control over mm -hmm. or not wanting to be where you are doing what you're doing at mm -hmm. that time, like hating it, which I think is what you probably help a lot of people work around when you coach them. Hey, what's up? Thanks for checking out my videos here on the Jess Marshall YouTube channel. Be sure to subscribe for sure. Hit that bell, press that button to watch the next video. If you got a question you have about any of the topics I bring up in the videos, drop a question below and we'll be sure to get an answer back to you ASAP. See you on the next one.